We've been to the movies. We've been around the world. And this season, we're going right back where it all began, at Camp Wawanaqua. I'm Chris McLean, and as you can see, things have changed since we've been away. And by changed, I meant gotten really, really dangerous. <laughs> Good stuff. But the rules of the game remain the same. A handful of unsuspecting teens will bunk with complete strangers, air their dirty laundry in our outhouse confessional, and compete in life-threatening challenges all over the island and risk being voted off. Last one standing wins one million dollars! Speaking of our cast, here they come now! <laughs> no, not them. This season, we've got all new players fighting for the million. And here they come now, for real. Meet Joe. Stay out of my way if you value your Kiwis. Scott. Right back at you. Zoe and Mike. Can you believe we're here? Yeah, it's beautiful. Lightning! Oh. Hello, gorgeous. Mwah. Brick! Brick MacArthur, reporting for duty. B and Don. Your aura is exceptionally purplish green. Oh, it suits you, though. Dakota! Hey there! <laughs> Dakota here, and I'm here And to Maria! Oh, yes. Three more coats ought to do it. Oh, whoa! Who said you could pan away? Don't push me, Blondie. <laughs> Stacy! My great aunt Millie invented suntans? Yeah, before her, people smeared themselves with clay. <laughs> Cameron! Fresh air! A real lake! Birds! Whoa! And Sam! Yeah. Oh, yeah! Grenade launcher upgrade. <laughs> now we're cooking. Yep, it's our roughest, toughest, most explosive season ever! Right here on Total Drama, Revenge of the Island. The mom and dad are doing fine. You guys are on my mind. You asked me what I wanted to be, and now I think the answer is plain to see. Text? For crying out loud! Unabody guest, over. You insist. <sighs> Hold on! <coughs> Thanks. I owe you one. 
Okay, my first confessional. So, uh, Zoe, nice girl. Okay, super nice. I wonder if she'll go out with a guy like me. See, I have this, um, quirk. I just hope my condition doesn't ruin everything for me again. Oh. Wow, I can't believe I'm actually in the Total Drama Confessional. It's so exciting. Everyone seems so nice. I hope they all like me. I could use a few new friends, or friends, period. Oh, what if they hate me? Maybe this flower was too big. Am I trying too hard? You like me, right? <sighs> Woohoo! That's what I'm talking about! First one on the gut! How did you... You're not even wet! Hmm? Oh, I used a shortcut. Oh. Ma'am? I may be the strongest player here, but I'm all about the teamwork. Back in Cadets, I took the teamwork medal three years running. Also, the bed-making medal, the flag-folding medal, and the letters home to mom medal. I always win that one. <coughs> I am what's known as a bubble boy. Growing up, my mom was really overprotective, so I've never gone swimming before. Up until six hours ago, I've never done anything before, except read and sigh a lot. <sighs> But that doesn't mean I'm not a force to be reckoned with. No way! Danaeus Plexippus, the monarch butterfly? Ah! Oh, it's so heavy! Yeah, and my great-great-great-uncle Boris invented swimming. Before him, people just swung their arms around like this and sang to the bottom. And my great-great-great-great-great-great... Yeah, that's great. <laughs> 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 I knew I should have played that sweet fitness workout game. <laughs> oh, I just hope I don't get cut first. That would be lame. But if I stick it out long enough to get cut six or even seventh, how cool would that be, huh? <laughs> so stoked to be here. I've been watching Total Drama forever. Who knows, maybe I'll even make some new friends. Yes. That would be good, considering you were an only child and all. What? Who told you that? Your soul reads like an open book. You had such a lonely childhood. It must have been difficult. Attention, fresh meat! See the trail leading into the forest? Race to the end of the trail and do not disturb the wildlife. That would be bad. Yeah, we wouldn't want to upset the bunnies. The tiniest sound can set them off. Like this! <laughs> yes! Sorry I had to lose to a girl. What girl? Lightning didn't lose, bro. Lightning never loses. Captain Modesty, two steps left, you're on Team A. Yo, Joe, move right, you're Team B. Pit Sniffer, you're Team A. Corporal Brickhouse, Team B. Sir, yes, sir! Silent Treatment, Team A. Bubble Boy, Team B. Okie dokie. <laughs> Zoe the Lonely, Team B. Only as a child? Seriously? The Aura Whisperer, Team A. Ah, saved by a girl, Team B. Princess Wannabe, Team A. Tan in a can, Team B. <laughs> Yo, Game Junkie, Team A. My Uncle Bill won the New York Marathon four times because marathons were first proposed by my great, great... Uh... And Chatty Stacy, Team A. What the heck was that thing in the forest? I'm pretty sure that cry does not belong to any known animal species. Relax, it'll all make sense eventually. <laughs> now, this season of Total Drama will be a little bit different. For example, in every episode, someone will be eliminated. <gasps> 
Oh. It's never been that hard before. I know, I'm good. But since you're all first timers, I'm gonna cut you a break and hide this bad boy somewhere in the campground. A genuine McLean brand Chris head. Your free ticket back into the game. Even if your teammates vote you off, whoever finds it will become the most powerful player in total drama history. Is the cleft on my chin really that big? Yep, and it looks like a butt. Moving on, time for the team names. Team Lightning! No, wait, Lightning Squad! Great suggestions, Lightning, but names have already been chosen by moi. Team A, you shall henceforth be known as the Toxic Rat. <laughs> Killer. And Team B, you are hereby dubbed the Mutant Maggot. Um, uh, what's with all the references to chemical waste? It's the monster! Ah! Hey, it's just a stupid squirrel! Uh... <gasps> oh my gosh, what's wrong with it? While we were gone, I rented the island out to a nice family-oriented biohazardous waste disposal company. Sweet people. But the waste is having a teensy bit of an impact on the flora and fauna. <laughs> cool. Weird. I want one. <laughs> Most danger ever. Hang on. Not too blotchy. Okay, take two. <clears throat> now, before we start our very first challenge of the season, let's give out some rewards. Joe, because you made it up here before anyone else, your team gets a trampoline. And the rats get a hacksaw. <laughs> What do these items have to do with this bomb? Um, he won't really blow us up again, will he? Won't I? Find out when we come back. Those are your team totems. You need to cut them down and get them in the river and ride them back to the campground. First team there gets their pick of the cabins. But hurry, the totems are rigged with bombs that will explode if you don't plant them in front of your cabin in seven minutes or less. Starting now. All right, let's do this! Yeah! Oh. Ah. Stand back! Lightning is on it! Whoa. Ah. Oh, dang, slippery tree! Don't worry, lightning never quits! It's too bad that my third cousin Jack isn't here to give us tips on barehanded tree climbing. Okay, if Joe hits the center of the trampoline with 50 pounds of pressure per square inch... Jack, Ooh. I want to crack at this. But I calculated for Joe's weight. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> win a million dollars, but not at the expense of my looks. I mean, check me out. Perfect hair, perfect tan. All this is worth a billion. Easy. And my great-great-great Aunt Dora actually taught Native Canadians to carve totems. Huh? Oh, okay. You want me on this thing? Whoa, hey! <laughs> you want me to stand here? Tree climbing is not a recognized sport. Plus, that tree was covered in butter or something. But if Chris is trying to make lightning look bad, he can't think again. Lightning never gives up and never surrenders. Shalightning. Time to win this. Good grief. Jeez, what a baby. Aw, oh, man, this isn't working. <gasps> Oh, darn it! Cut the dang rope already! That's what we're trying to do, Mike. Mike means Chester, Missy. 
Uh, excuse me? Mike is so sweet. You know, I really don't get his old man comedy routine, but I bet it's really funny if you're from, like, France or something. Ah! Lightning strikes! <laughs> Uh, uh, go away! Hey, shoot! Shoot! <laughs> Back in my day, we didn't need fancy saws and axes to cut ropes. We did just fine with stone. <laughs> One more person will do it. Dakota? Timber! No time for photo ops, Dakota. Take it easy! He's so smart, but once my plan goes into action, he won't know what hit him. Go! They're gaining on us! It's my duty to inform you, ma'am, that we have bigger problems. <gasps> my first waterfall! And maybe our last! <laughs> Today in their crazy log rides. Huh? <gasps> Zoe! Ah! Zoe! Hang on tight! Okay. Thanks, Mike. Uh -huh. No problem. Ah! Ah! All right! Yeah! He wants us to lean forward! Yeah! My great, 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 great second on Mary invented log riding, and she we don't, don't care. care! Hey! How do they get in front of us? Ah, oh, feels good to be back. Hey, Chris, get this. The boat wouldn't stop. Oh, look, it's former player Owen, who's not competing this year. Yeah, so I swam back to tell you that... What? Not competing? I'm afraid you and the other classic players have outlived your usefulness. Chef? Ah! Team Lightning! Tick tock! Quick! Grab the good cabin! Uh, uh, uh. Nice! Yeah. 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 Too bad. It had an eight-person hot tub and air conditioning. Yeah, my great-great-great uncle James invented log cabins. Before him, people had to sleep in the trees, and they kept falling out all the time. And my great-great-great-great-great aunt Phyllis invented roofs, and before her, houses were just walls and furniture. And every time it rained, you had to get a new sofa. <laughs> Regardless, as the only team with a cabin still standing, the mutant maggots win the first challenge. Yay! So where am I gonna sleep? No worries. We've got a backup cabin for you. It's every bit as nice as the one you lost. Oh. Crap! Team Rat, I'll see you at the campfire for our first elimination ceremony of the season. <laughs> 
The votes are cast. Those who receive a regular marshmallow can stay. But this season, one player will receive a very special marshmallow. A marshmallow you do not want to eat. Whoever gets the marshmallow of toxic loserdom is out of the contest, which means you can't come back ever. The following players are safe. Scott, B, Lightning, Dawn, and Sam. And the marshmallow of toxic loserdom goes to... Stacy. Aw, but I was doing so good. <sighs> I guess it's the dock of shame for me then. Actually, we came up with something new this season. You'll love it. Say hello to the Hurl of Shame, Pat and Penny. Yeah, a catapult were invented by my great, 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 One down, 12 to go. Who's next in line? Find out next time, right here on Total Drama Revenge.